right everybody today we're going to be doing a little battery test on the XO X7 Ranger <sighs> never did that yet I got six complete charges and discharges on it so we're going to be able to do that today finally so it says 8.49 volts battery fully charged GPS mode now I'm not gonna just hover it I'm just gonna fly it around you know put a little bit of real-time usage on it um, you know so and then I'm gonna run the video too so I mean because people run the video when they're flying so that's gonna drain the battery a little here also so let's start the video up okay so that's working and let's take off Got my part of my stuff here blowing away. Okay, so that was the take off and land button. I'm not sure. I don't even remember because it's been, of course, a long time since I've flown this thing. But uh, I don't remember what those two buttons in the back are for, to be honest with you. And I'll put the little timer in there like I always do. The little clock. You know, I got this, uh, mine has this faulty stick. I probably shouldn't even use the damn stick, to be honest. Because the thing don't work for crap falls off all the time right uh, right there if you guys can see it see that little stick there it falls out of there all the time you know very annoying yeah I've never flown this thing down the whole battery so We're going to do that today. So far it's been riding 2 minutes and 24 seconds a video. I might cut the video, cut the video up. It's really windy out though, to be honest with you. It's probably wouldn't even fly today if it wasn't for this doing this little battery test. I wouldn't even be flying. So I gotta believe one of these buttons because it's only in the first rate. That's the gimbal button, by the way. The one on the one I couldn't figure out what it was, that was the gimbal button.
kind of dancing around a little bit, but I don't know. I don't know if that's hurting anything. Yeah, that wind is kind of gusting a lot there. That's why it's dancing around so much. Usually it flies usually a lot better than this, but you know, it is what it is. Yeah, I'm gonna make, try to glue this on here. I think that's probably gonna be my best bet, some power grab. It's very annoying when you're flying and that thing falls off. It really, to be honest with you, it really pisses you off big time. Oh yeah, this thing is fighting. It's trying, to, I got it in orbit mode actually, to be honest, right now I do. Uh, and it, you see it's struggling against the wind to try to make the orbits. You know, it's like fighting, uh, it's fighting the headwind for the orbit, so. But it's, it's getting there, man. It's, it's getting there. It's a trooper, okay. Now, I don't know how long it's been going so far because... Um, the it does little five minute segments of video it doesn't record one you know the timer doesn't show you the whole video time every time it gets to five minutes it restarts to zero so you you don't know by looking at that how long you've been flying I think it's this is the second segment of video right now so it's on three minutes I think into the second segment so eight minutes so far since I hit the record I'm down to 7.3 volts and the battery is showing on the thing up here that it's at 50 percent so let me bring it down a little hair because it'll still keep doing the orbits from what I remember so I can look at the battery gauge on the quadcopter go take a look at that Yeah, it's showing the two, the two lights there. Okay, so I'm gonna wait till it gets to the five minutes for the second video clip. So at least it's not hovering. This is more like a real time. It's actually flying, you know, and using the ESCs up. Okay. So it's actually draining what would be normal amount of power under, you know, standard usage.
Oh yeah, the battery really took a 7.2 volts. It went into the yellow. So, okay, so it went into, so now it's been going 10 minutes. Now, I don't want to hurt the battery at all, but it looks like it's, like it's getting ready to land there. I'm going to push it a little bit more. But not much more. So I know I can get 10 minutes out of it. But the... Let me look at this. It's still showing two, but it's flashing red. It's, oh, there it goes. Okay, I'm gonna bring it in. I can't get the motors to stop, so there's my dilemma now. Now ain't this some crap? Stop, you doofus. <laughs> God damn it. See, now if I just let it go, it's going to want to take back off. Okay. There it goes. Good lord. What a pain. It did take a nice little smack coming down there, but... Okay, so now you know. Do not let it go into the fail, you know, complete battery failure mode because it's going to act all crazy. Okay, so... As you just saw. All right, guys, there you go. I'll put the little timer in there, and then we can see what the flight time is. But I'm going to say it's going to be around 10 minutes. It says low battery on there. All right, guys, I'll talk to you later. Have a nice day.